start your letter? At the top. Where do you start your letter? At the top. If you want to start a letter, then you better, better, better remember to start it at the top. Is this the top, top, top? No, it's the bottom. Is this the top, top, top? No, it's the middle. Is this the top, top, top? It's the top. Hey Magnolia friends, let's write some new letters today. Today we'll start with T. Don't forget your pincher grip. And don't forget to start at the top. T is a straight line down and a short straight line across the top. A straight line down and a short straight line across the top. Let's try some teeny tiny writing again. Make sure you have a good grip. Back to the top, just your fingers, down and across. T. Let's try a new letter. Let's try U. We're gonna go back to the top. U has a straight line down Curve at the bottom and right back up. Straight line down, curve at the bottom and right back up. Let's do some teeny tiny writing, just your fingers. Back to the top, straight line down, curving up. Great job, that's a U. Next, we're gonna do V. Sometimes U and V are tricky. Remember, V has two diagonal straight lines, no curve at the bottom like U. We'll go back to the top. Remember, diagonal comes down to the side a little bit. And then another diagonal to the side. V, let's do another one. Diagonal to the side, back up to the side. Let's do a little teeny tiny V. Tight pincher grip. That one's tiny. How tiny can your V be? Our last letter today is W. W's tricky. Four diagonal straight lines. Let's go to the top, diagonal to the side, diagonal to the side, diagonal to the side, and back up for our last diagonal. Lots of diagonals. Let's do it again, back up to the top, diagonal to the side, diagonal to the side, diagonal to the side, and back up to the top. W is going to be tricky for teeny tiny, but I know you can do it. Back up to the top. Diagonal, 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 and back up. W. Great writing today, friends. 